are watching BNS News. Today's headline data shows 500 million plus dollars in EPS transfer to Binance yesterday. Dubai authorities serve notice to OPNX co-founder Soju Adas. Coinbase faces suit over alleged privacy violations in biometrics collection. BB Doge team announces burn of 500 trillion BB Doge coins. Blend NFT lending protocol gets mixed reactions from the community. Polynix settles with US authorities pay $10.6 million fee to OFAC. Level Finance loses over $1 million as DeFi hit by yet another hack. ARK Invest spends Intel workers day buying $8 million in Coinbase shares. Darknet hackers are selling crypto accounts for a low as $30 app pop. On-chain data shows a declining amount of $1 million BTC transactions. Litecoin community introduces LTC20, an experimental standard for NFTs. Bitcoin requests for comment tokens surge to $137 million in market value. The blockchain intelligent firm Santiment posted a tweet on their official Twitter page yesterday. According to the tweet, $505 million worth of Ethereum was transferred to Binance yesterday. The post added that it is the largest self-custody to exchange transfer in five years. According to the latest reports, the VARA authorities issued a written reprimand to Zoo, another 3AC co-founder Kali Davis, and three other in relation to license-related violations of OPNX. The issue came to the light around two weeks after the reprimand was issued while further investigations is underway, the authorities said. Coinbase violated biometric privacy laws in Illinois through its collections and storage of customers' fingerprints and facial templates, a proposed class action lawsuit alleges. Baby Doge, a cryptocurrency birthed by the Doge meme online community fans in June 2021, continues to attract users and mess even as it learns few tricks and lessons from its meme father. On May 1st, Blur launched a peer-to-peer -peer perpetual lending protocol called Blend, a platform they developed with the help of the venture capital firm Paradigm. The protocol supports NFT collaterals and the team claims that it would collect zero fees from the both lenders and borrowers. Polynex LLC has agreed to pay a fee of $7.6 million to settle with the U.S. Treasury Department's Office to Foreign Asset Control for violations of sanctions. The decentralized finance ecosystem was hit by yet another hack as decentralized capital market level finance was hacked for $1.1 million by an unknown attacker. The investment company also bought 23,456 Coinbase shares for its ARK Next Innovations Internet ETF and 15,809 for its FinTech Innovations ETF. The entire purchase amounted to 1,68,869 Coinbase shares worth around $8.5 million. 